Hi, I'm Nick. And I'm Carmen. And this is Oak Channel. And we're back with another video. And as you can see, we're now in Vegas, but this video is going to be places to eat at resorts in Atlantic City. So one thing that we forgot to mention in the last video of things to do is that uh, Resorts Atlantic City has a Wet Willies on their boardwalk. So once, before you get into the margarita section, you're gonna see the Wet Willies. Remember, we forgot to mention that. Yeah. Yeah, so if you like to have daiquiris, the Wet Willies on the boardwalk. We also ate at Margaritaville, but we'll talk about that in the end. We're not gonna give you an unguided tour of the quick places to eat on the casino floor. places that you will see once you enter the casino we weren't able to go to the fine dine restaurants that they do have but we'll link them down below so another place to eat at resorts casino is called land sharks that's located on the boardwalk of atlantic city right in front of resorts right you can also consider it a thing to do because they play music 24 7 so you will find some people dancing in the front but it's a restaurant. And the last place that we're gonna mention is Margaritaville because we did eat there. And for me, it was a disappointing dinner because I ordered a salad and it was just like, how can you mess up a salad? I ordered the Southwest salad and the Southwest salad usually comes with chicken and cheese, but I tell them to put it on the side so I can give the chicken nick. And the salad was missing the black beans and the avocado. And then they brought it in and then when I was trying to eat it, the lettuce, were soggy. What that means is that they created the salad and they let it sit there because my salad came it's soggy. Our food came late. Too. Yeah, the food came really late, and then my my salad was soggy. The fries were cold. You don't eat cold fries. His food was fine. What did you order? I ordered the jambalaya. Right. He ordered the jambalaya. It was nice and warm when mm -hmm. it arrived. Right. So they must have made my salad and the fries and let it sit there and then forgot about it and then. Our waiter had to go in and look for, like, find out what was going on with our meal. So it was a disappointment. Um, and I don't think I'll go back because it was just a bad experience. I have been to Margaritaville before and it wasn't, the salad was really good. They made sure to include everything. But there are so many other restaurants that I'd rather try out and not waste my time going there and then hope, and hoping that I don't get the same service. Um, well, actually, the reason why it was kind of like a bad um, service was because based on you going to Margaritaville before and that's being good, you are expecting it to be the same way. But, right, know. yeah, right. So that's what I was expecting for my salad to be as I remembered. But, it but wasn't. do you think they kind of messed it up because it was busy or it just... It wasn't even that busy. You're supposed to make it actually after. You're supposed to make your salad after you made my food. Right. You don't make the salad before you make his food because the salad sits there and gets soggy and it's just like... How do you think, how do you bring out that food thinking that it's okay? A soggy salad and then cold fries. It's just like the 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 manager in the back should have been checking that. Like, no, it's been sitting out, you gotta make it again. But hoping that nobody cared, whoever's gonna eat it's just gonna eat it and not complain. No, that's not how you treat your customers. So just that experience, I don't think I will go back to Margaritaville. However, that was my experience 
we're not saying for you not to go because you might go and you obviously will maybe enjoy your food because you may not be a vegan. It's just harder for us vegans when we go out to eat <clears throat> because it's mostly salads that they give us. Mm -hmm. And then if you don't even make the salad right, it's just like annoying. But that is a video on places to eat at Resorts Atlantic City. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. Also, stay tuned for our Vegas videos because that's coming up next week. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a Vegas series. So we did mention that we're going to be giving you guys three videos. The tour of the room, things to do here in Paris, and places to eat in Paris. We might give you some other videos because we did stay at Horseshoe, so we can give you that. But we didn't see any comments or questions about Vegas. So those are the videos you guys are going to get because we're going to try to enjoy our trip and not record the whole time we're here. That's correct. Okay, so make sure you leave your comments and questions below. We truly appreciate you guys. We appreciate our subscribers. We especially appreciate our day one subscriber, Karin, because she's been rocking with us from... Day one? <laughs> day one. Watching every watching every video commenting on every uh video giving us suggestions information we also so vid very interactive follower subscriber because he has a he or she has a lot of questions sorry we don't know your name because you never told us but um we appreciate you but we really truly appreciate all of you guys we do make sure to check out our comments and we try to answer every question that you guys have. We appreciate them. So please leave those questions and comments below so that we know what we should be looking for. So hopefully you guys will comment on our last video because by the time we post this video, we'll be back home. <laughs> yep. And if there's any place you guys want us to visit, let us know. We'll try to make that visit for you guys. Yes, exactly. Because we're already planning our trip in October for his birthday. So um, we'll let you guys know where we're going in a later at a later time. But we have a lot of trips planned. But if you guys want to see some more locations before you visit, let us know, like Nick mentioned. And uh, again, make sure you share these videos with your friends and family that love to travel and love casinos. Yep. And remember, like, like and subscribe. subscribe.